what is going on welcome back to finley timekeeping it's your boy back at you with another video in this video we're going to be doing a review of the casio duro this is a borrow from a friend he let me borrow it for this video this is not mine this is not a sponsored post we will be sending it back so the reason why i'm reviewing this is because i've been seeing a lot about this watch on youtube on facebook and everything like that it's just a budget for budget watch now for this watch price let's talk price first this watch you can get off amazon for right at 50 dollars again 50 dollars for this right before tax before shipping ignore the paracord that's a something specific we're just talking about the watch for now it's a quartz movement it has a 200 meters of water resistance now this is very very eye-catching because i bought a orient kamasu which you guys know of which also has 200 meters of water resistance but it's an automatic so i'm getting the same water resistance in a bigger package with a quartz movement so that's something that's very, very eye-catching. There's also a rotating bezel on here. As you can tell, I was messing with it earlier, but in case you weren't listening, you hear that action on there. 120 click unidirectional bezel, which has the um, same black steel as the rest of the case. This thing looks absolutely killer. In my honest opinion, I think this is dope. It has a screw down case back, as well as a, let's see, I believe it has a screw down crown as well. Yes, it has a screw down crown as well. So you have to pull it out. It also comes with a date window at the three o'clock. Little dolphin right here, if this camera would focus. All right, Casio on the front looks very, very good. In comparison, again, to my Orient Kamasu, as you can tell, not that much of a difference. Obviously the color and trim, but the dial layout is the exact same. And so overall, this seems really, really nice for the value of it. In my opinion, I'm gonna get one of these. I think this is really, really nice, really, really dope. They have a variety of colors. They released a Kermit um, here recently. There's a blue variation, a black and gold variation, like my Kamasu. And this is overall just a very, very good watch. It comes on a rubber strap. I'm probably gonna get it on a steel bracelet or just keep it on the rubber strap. It really just depends on how I feel. Overall, if I was to give it a score out of 10, this is a solid, solid eight. The only reason is I would prefer that it be an automatic because I just like to see the sweep of an automatic movement and I have enough quartz watches at home, but for a quartz watch, this thing is absolutely great. You're looking at a 44 millimeter case diameter, you're looking at 12 millimeters thick and a 48 millimeter lug to lug. And overall, really, really good watch, really, really just it's got really high value for what you're paying for it especially you can get a variety of colors if i was someone who would really just bank on this watch i would get in all the colors I was getting every color that came in i just think this is really really good let me know what you think in the comment section below i want to know how you guys feel about this again i think this thing is really really dope you should try it out for yourself let me know in the comment section below don't forget to like comment subscribe and share holla back to your boy i see you on the next one peace